Last year, New York City imposed tougher fines and penalties for people who illegally ride ATVs and dirt bikes on the street. But CBS 2's Corey James spoke with residents who believe that the city has done little to stop it. It's literally hundreds coming down the block. Some Upper East Side neighbors say this is happening at all hours of the day, multiple times a week. ATVs and dirt bikes taking over New York City streets illegally. It's a real problem. Lynn Genovis lives near 74th Street and 1st Avenue. He recorded video of the ongoing activity that he says is jeopardizing public safety. I've had some close calls. You can't cross the street when it's happening. If you do, you're putting yourself in danger. This footage shows riders popping wheelies in Chelsea as they spread across all lanes of traffic for an Easter Sunday cruise. It's gotten really bad. Ryan Myers also lives on the Upper East Side. He says the illegal riding is nonstop near his building, which is not too far from Mayor Adams. I'm shocked that uh, with him being so close that nothing has been done. We asked Council Member Eric Dinowitz about the issue. I do not think enough is being done to ensure our safety and to protect and improve our quality of life here in New York City. We know the reasons why high-speed chases in New York City are not a good idea, but we need the NYPD to, to have a presence and to enforce the laws that exist. According to a police source, the NYPD last April to October took more than 3,000 dirt bikes, ATVs, mopeds, motorcycles, and scooters off the street. Our source says because this is a seasonal problem, enforcement efforts are currently ramping up. And after we started asking questions about what is being done, the NYPD posted this on social media, saying 10 bikes and ATVs were seized in the Edenwald houses in the Bronx. Those who are fed up with the noise would like to see more of this. I think they really need to get them off the street, confiscate them. Corey James, CBS 2 News.